Next up, we have oral presentation 30, Ector County, Texas, Team 1, Mission 12, Finalist Proposal. Good morning, everybody. I'm Principal Investigator Damien Galindo. Unfortunately, my co-principal investigator, Damien Carrasco and Leo Lopez couldn't be here today. This is for the finalist proposal, decom Decomposition in Space. Background. Why do we want to send a mushroom into space? Mushrooms play an important role in their environment as they help um, break down organic, organic matter and leaves and stems, and they also are vital for the living and support life of trees. Though not all mushrooms grow on trees, the other help um, grasses in the floor, in the ground, sorry. Enochian mushrooms, why do we want to send them in the first place? Not only do they fit the tube dimensions, but they're also good for the human body as they help aid um, body fat, increase bowel movements, and prevent constipation. The history of the project. Not many experiments have done with the mushroom as a whole, but some have been conducted with um, which way the mushroom would go in microgravity. And as we all know, we have a huge pollution problem here on Earth, and we are essentially um, destroying the atmosphere, and so we need to migrate to another planet or fix our pollution problem. Um, mushrooms will be very important to start a new colonization on another planet as they do help support lives in their ecosystem. Future work. Why is it important for this experiment to be conducted? Fungi decompose organic matter by releasing the enzyme to break down the decaying matter. Hyphate is used to break down the matter and absorb nutrients after they get rid of the bones or anything else that is waste. They also recycle nitrogen back into plants through, um, through a nitrogen called ammonia, which is usable for plants and help them live. Personal experiences. This, is how help, this has helped all of us have a better understanding of our future as this has shifted our views into science fields and has made us, and had made us closer all together. These are our sources and our source of photos. Acknowledgements, we would like to thank Hector County ISD Innovation Department, the Education Foundation of Odessa, the Texas Space Grant Consortium, and a special thanks to Chevron, SSEP, and Jeff Goldenstein. Thank you. Gabriel, Burleson, Texas, how did you stumble upon this type of mushroom for your experiment? Well, we know we wanted to work with the mushroom at the beginning. We just didn't know which one. We had to do several researches on mushrooms to see which one would fit the two dimensions. And this one happened to fit the two dimensions. You have to grow them in abundance because some grow bigger than others. So if we were to grow them, um, we would have to pick the smaller ones so they would be able to fit in the tube. Thank you, sir. 